Rob, any of those questions from last night's workshop. Oh, great. Come on in. You can see those. That was a good group we had last night. That's time. a good group. Good questions. Uh, any of these jump out at you? Yeah, actually. Is the executor obligated to carry out the wishes of the beneficiaries? Oh yeah, that was a good one. Um, and of course the answer is no. Did I answer it last night? You did answer it. Okay. Uh, and the answer is no. The executor draws his uh, authority from the will and from the court, not from the beneficiaries. Um, the executor is in kind of a unique position because He's nominated by someone who's now dead, the decedent, uh, and he's appointed by a judge who then pretty much usually leaves the executor on his own to take care of his responsibilities as he sees fit. Now, that doesn't mean the executor is a free agent to just do what he thinks and um, or do as he pleases. He does. He's a fiduciary, which is a high duty. It's the highest duty under law, and he has a responsibility to settle the estate prudently and to give, to transmit or convey the assets of the estate to the beneficiaries. So he has to carry out those duties uh, according to a high duty. Um, and um, as, long as, he, as long as the executor is diligent and doesn't engage in uh, self-dealing, then he has a lot of discretion in how he carries out those duties. Um, and for example, let's say that there's a house in, among the assets of the estate. And then the executor is going to be responsible for preserving that house and conveying it to the beneficiary or selling the house and uh, passing the proceeds of sale to the beneficiary while the house is in his care, he's clearly going to want to keep uh, insurance coverage on the house. He does not want the house to burn down with no insurance while he's responsible for it. So he's going to be sure to keep in insurance coverage on the house, but it's the executor's uh, discretion to, dis to choose what policy to buy and to pay for it. And of course, the executor will pay for it out of the assets of the estate. Um, now, the beneficiaries really should try not to make the executor's job any harder than it is. Um, the executor's generally doing a, they're generally investing a lot of time and energy into settling this estate and frequently for no compensation. So, and even if the executor is compensated, it's going to be the compensation is not going to be enough to really pay for the value of the service that the executor is rendering to the estate. So really the appropriate attitude for a beneficiary toward the executor is patience and appreciation. Great. Would you like me to talk about that? Yeah, that would be great. Mm -hmm. Let's put it into an FAQ and we'll post it on the website. Okay. Good. Thank you, Sierra. Thank you.